Hello everybody, Yabs from Gear Games here, and today we're going to do uh, part one of my video on social things on your site. So, uh, by social things, I mean uh, Twitch feeds, like buttons, plus one buttons, that those are quite easy to put in, and uh, Facebook streams and tweet buttons, and all that good stuff. Now... Uh, the first thing I'm going to show you to put in, and probably the easiest thing, is a Facebook stream. If we uh, go onto Facebook, go onto my website, go onto my Facebook stream, and then go onto the Get Started button uh, tab. And then press add a like box. Now what we are going to want to do is, when this comes up, is first enter your Facebook page that you want to like. So for me, it is Yav J Games. So just copy and paste that in there. Now you want your width and the, your height of your gadget in pixels. Next you want the colour scheme. There are two options, light and dark. For my site I chose light because that's sort of your standard Facebook colours. But there's also dark. You can then show faces. Faces are just these things down here. Mm -hmm. Border colour, you can just leave that blank. Show stream, which is just this thing up here. This is what's called the stream. And show header, which is just that thing there. You can find us on Facebook. So once you have set that all up, I've done that very quickly, you're going to want to press get code. And then iframe. Now, iframe code is not available for all the gadgets. So, for instance, the like button, uh, you cannot get iframe code for it, but that's the only thing that will work with uh, Google uh, Sites. So, just simply copy that code, edit your site, press H, uh, select where you want it to be, put in your code, uh, we'll put it inside this div tag here just well outside the div tag you just simply paste it press up update press save and what do you know there we go we have our facebook stream you can then like the page of course i cannot like my own page because i'm the admin anyway the next thing we want to get in is the Twitter stream. Now, getting Twitter streams in is a little bit harder. Not that much. Okay. What you're going to want to do to get that in is to download the XML document at my website, yabsmajagames.co.cc, uh, link in the description to the very page. And you'll download some code like this. I'm using Dreamweaver, you can use uh, a Notepad++, plus plus. Uh, really anything that will edit code. Uh, Notepad++ plus plus is free and is fairly good for editing things like this. But anyway, I hope you can Dreamweaver. Uh, the first thing you're going to want to do is in here set your username so I'll put in uh, my personal Twitter Let's go to the games Yab, Yab J. leave this as it is now the next thing you're going to want to do is set the custom colors so if you go onto my website uh,
these are my custom colours. So my links are blue, the background is blue, and and yeah, basically. And the text is this sort of, it's not black, it's the same grey that my site layout uses. So to edit the colours, you'll, you'll notice it doesn't just say green or blue. It's these funny codes. If you've ever edited a website before properly, you'll know that these are colour codes. Now, tools such as Photoshop and Fireworks, you you can pick those in there. But if you don't have tools like that, you will need to go to this website here, colorpicker.com. Select colour. Let's say I wanted bright green. Simply select code, go into Dreamweaver and then just replace it like that. Uh, I'll then edit another colour uh, just to show that it has actually changed. Let's select uh, so a funny brownish colour, select that, go into Dreamweaver, replace that. There we go. We'll then save the code. Now the next thing you're going to want to do is to upload that file. So the way you upload the file onto your site is going to uh, manage site, attachments, uh, upload, uh, find your code which is me in web page cutout one. There we go. Now that is not going to work because there are spaces in the name. So that's another thing to remember. You can't have space in the name. So if you do say the file with spaces in, just simply go up to rename and backspace all your spaces and press rename. Now the next thing you're going to want to do is copy and paste that code, copy that name and then go and edit your site. This time we're going to insert more gadgets, add gadget by URL, paste what you just copied and pasted in there, and then copy that, delete HHTTP, all that stuff, paste that in, press add, if all works should be greeted with something that looks a little bit like that. We don't want to display a title on the gadget. Press OK. Then press Save. Uh, press there, Load load Anyway. And there we go, with my personal Twitter in a nice shade of green. That's been Yab Semi J Games.